I thought you were in there. Dad was cleaning your car. I wanted to help um, by pulling the carrots. Down. You wanted to help clean the car by pulling the carrots? No. <laughs> Wait, is this a carrot? That's not a carrot. So these ones are the carrots. I found a big one. Big one? Oh, these are all connected. So? Yeah. Oh. <gasps> That's a big one. Whoa. Oh. Yeah, we're gonna pull all of them, so even if they're small, it's okay. See, like this little, little guy. We're gonna pull all of those? All of them, every single one. Oh, I found a huge one, look. Oh, he's a little baby. Oh. <laughs> It's a greedy size. Yeah, yeah. Brush the dirt off a little bit. And you eat it like a like a bunny rabbit. Bunny rabbits eat like this. Uh, what's that? Yuck. <laughs> Where do I put the trash? Um, right back in here. Cause you know what the trash does. Oh, makes it, makes a seed and then makes it grow back all again. It gives life to the soil. Here we go. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, you think that's a big one? Oh. It's not a big one, but I just pulled. It's like a lot of little ones. Yeah, because they're all stuck together. Get away from me, fly. Just because I shower doesn't mean you have to get me dirty because you're jealous that you're dirty. Did you guys hear that? <laughs> what did you say, Grady? Just because, <laughs> just because you shower and you're not dirty, the fly is jealous of you? because they want to eat too. Oh, this is like a baby size. That's a baby baby size. Yeah, so I will save <gasps> that one. Oh my God. It's crazy. It's a perfect one. It's perfectly orange too. Let's see what else we got. <gasps> This oh my orange. god, the ones over here are the orange ones. I guess so. Wait. Wait, I think one is heavy. Wait. I found one. Wait. No, <laughs> it's a baby baby. <laughs> this one's the biggest one, right, Megan? Yeah, probably. But the big orange one is the perfect sized one, which is this one, right? Whoa! It's a little, little baby one, but a little bit bigger, right? <laughs> yeah. Are we going to pull any more plants out? Just all of this today. So we're Look gonna at this! Okay. That's a little baby baby. Oh, now that one's the bigger one. Wait, let's see if, let's see which one's bigger. Oh, yours is way bigger. You definitely got the bigger one. Wait, I found a little, little baby. Look, Ooh. this is cool. Look what I found. It's called a grub worm. They're not good for the garden, but you know who loves them? Who? Say sorry now. <laughs> you want to give it to the chickens? 
Why grub worms not good? Uh, because they eat my plants. Throw it towards them. I believe I can fly. There it goes. Grady went off to hide a carrot for the Easter Bunny. I don't know where he went. I put it in the safe hidden spot. See it? I didn't. You can show me later. Is that all? Uh, no, you got some more. I have a good feeling about this one too. You have good feelings about all of them. Oh, look. Yeah, I have a good feeling about all of them. I have the biggest big feeling about this one. Why is that? <gasps> That's a good one. That's a pretty darn good one. We should have that one for dinner. We should. Look at that, you got a couple more left. Wait, wait. What about this one too? Ooh. <laughs> wait, these look the same. They do. Wait, is there any more roly polies? They're all asleep because it's still winter time. Oh. Well, my job is not done here. <laughs> I still need to harvest the rest of these root vegetables. Excuse me, I just had a coughing fit. <laughs> um, so, I need to pull out the rest of these root vegetables, which is gonna be all my daikon radishes, all of my albino white beets, and then all of the carrots, of course, because I'm trying to get these beds done before the end of March. It has been unseasonably warm <laughs> here uh, in this fall spring, and I am starting to think that the last frost is going to come sooner rather than later. For the past two years, it's been pretty cold here in the springs. Um, I haven't planted out until after the first week in April because it's still been freezing every night. But this year it's been really warm. And so I'm starting to think that I'll be able to plant my spring vegetables out sooner. So that's kind of putting the rush on me to get as much harvested as I can so I can reamend these beds and get them ready for uh, my plants to come. And just to show you how warm it's been getting, I've already got some of these radishes bolting or going to seed, um, which I kind of want to leave them because these are the radishes from goingtoseed.org and I really want to save seeds from them. As you can see here, this is a flower stalk and this is going to put out flowers pretty shortly. So this is gonna turn into flowers and put out seeds once it's pollinated. And I think this one, this one's also going to seed. You done on the trampoline? No, I thought you were gonna jump with me. I gotta finish. I gotta do all this. Remember, we're doing all this today. This whole thing? This whole thing. What is this? These are radishes. Remember that one time I had you pull up a really big one? Oh yeah. You wanna pull up that one? This is a whole radish. Look at this whole thing. Remember when I, it was so heavy that I had to do this? Uh-huh, you might have to do that again. <laughs> Can you get it? <laughs> <laughs> oh, you got it. How big is it? It's almost like the size of those big things at the beach, right? Yep. Bro, I found another big one. Oh, these are all gonna be big ones, buddy. Is this a carrot? No, that's a radish. It looks kind of like a carrot, though. A lot like a carrot, huh? That's a little... You want this? Yep, this is a radish. Oh, 
I think this one's the biggest one. I think so. I'm gonna have to hold on to this, right? Yeah, probably. Whoa. Not even that big. Not that big. <laughs> Good thing it doesn't have that much dirt. Yeah. OMG. Oh, it'll be easier to get it from over here, buddy. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Why did it go big? I don't know. It's pretty crazy. Hello. <laughs> This one is pretty big. That one's pretty big. We could probably pull that one. Oh, oh it's a big one. Whoa! Oh my god. That's like the first one. Uh-huh. Oh, look. A little teeny tiny baby. Why do some radishes look like the carrots? I don't know. Oh! Look! Oh, that's a little tiny radish. This one's so cute. This is the smallest one ever, right? Mm-hmm. Wait, no! They're eating the leaves instead. How ungrateful. <laughs> Look what I found in here. A deer bone? I don't know if it's from a deer, but it is a bone. If it's a human. <laughs> Your face. Wait a second. You're a silly one, you know that? We can post this on YouTube and say what YouTube says, right? What do you mean what YouTube says? Like, if it's a deer bone or... Yeah, it's definitely probably a deer bone. Because we put our deer bones in the compost when we're done. What's a compost? A compost pile? It's like a pile of trash that becomes dirt. Oh, look at this weird one. That's definitely for the chickens. That's not for Let them grow right. It's definitely chicken food. Okay, so this is the radishes and the carrots are over here. Look, take a look. See that? And these, these round white ones, these are beets. It's called a beet. So the radishes are the big long ones we pull up, but these little small white ones, it's called a beet. Oh, the big, but what about the big one? That was a radish. Oh. Yeah. The big one that like had a circle on it. Oh, yeah, that was a radish too. Wait, could I try? So we're gonna just cut the leaves off. Because right. we don't want the yeah, radish don't. to die. Well, no, so we're gonna give the leaves to the chickens because we eat this. And the chickens eat And the chickens that. eat the grass. That way, everyone gets fed. And it's all fair and square. It's all fair and square. Some of these you can just rip off like this. You wanna try it? You think you can break it? Easily. Easily? Oh, that was too easy for you. Do some more. Or you could just twist them off like an egg. Twist them off. Should have known that. <laughs> no, I, I was gonna put that there. Uh, okay. These go there and the leaves go here. There go. I think I could pull this off with my hand. Oh, that one's a hard one. I don't know about that. You got it? Oh, you're right, the twisting does work better. Almost there. Oh! You got it? Yeah. Wait. I did it! You did it. Look at that. You're strong. 
like my dad. Definitely. Maybe even stronger. Because I can carry a 10. Carry a 10? Yeah. Let's carry a 10. Like a 10 dumbbell. Oh, you can carry a 10 pound dumbbell? Yeah. That's pretty good. I want a small one. Oh, this one's pretty big. This though. one's a small one. Oh. The twisting does work for <laughs> oh, easy peasy, rabbit squeezy. <laughs> the big ones are pretty easy too. Yeah, they are. You want to go show your dad what we did? Yeah, we got some pretty big ones too. Yeah, we did. Because oh we could show him through the window. You think he's in bed? He is in bed. Look at that. What'd you get? <clears throat> we got carrots and radishes. Carrots and radishes. Look how big this radish is. This was our first one, right? Was. That was his first one he pulled up all by himself. Yeah. That and like a and a big and a big one I and the big one I twisted off. Like a big huge leaf that was on this one, I did this. I was hoping I'd get to talk to you guys some more while I was harvesting, but Grady stuck around and helped me with everything. It kind of makes me uncomfortable to like talk to the camera <laughs> while I'm, while someone's here, like I'm just ignoring them from the conversation, even though it's not really happening. It just feels weird. <laughs> Um, as for the albino beets, guys, those were severely disappointing this year. I've never grown them before, and I'm not much of a beet person anyways. Uh, I had told you guys at the beginning of the fall that I was excited to grow the albino beets because they were a good sugar beet. How you make a beet sugar, I guess. I don't even know how to do that, but I was excited to try the beets and possibly make beet sugar. But these just didn't um, bulb up very well. They were really small, so I don't know. We'll see. We'll try them again next year because I still have seeds, of course. But they were pretty disappointing. Maybe it got too cold and I don't know. Like I said, I don't really like beets a whole bunch. I don't grow them. So we'll make use of the small ones we've got in some way or another. I haven't figured out how yet, <laughs> but other than that, it was a pretty good harvest, and surprisingly, the all of my root vegetables lasted me all winter. I'm glad that the carrots finally started growing again, uh, because they were growing so slow over the entire winter, and I was like, man, I, I'm not even going to be able to get carrots, but then it's been so warm that they've just taken off, so we got a good number of carrots too. And I'm so happy for the spring season to start. <laughs> And thankfully, most of the broccoli that I left to go to seed has already started flowering. And there are a ton of pollinators hanging around here, including the dreaded cabbage moth. But thankfully, I'm not going to be needing to eat any of these brassicas so they can have at it to their heart's desire. Oh, there's a bee. Hi, little bee. Hey ladies, this is the first time I've seen you here. Beautiful girls. That makes me happy. They are literally the reason I left the flowers there. <laughs> so these are the flowers from the broccoli. Ca cauliflower. Cauliflower? Yeah, the white ones are cauliflower and the green ones are broccoli over here. So all there's, this is cauliflower. There's even more cauliflower and I think... Are you going to give us a garden tour? What? Are you going to give us a garden tour? What is that? Like you're going to tell everyone what we got? Yeah. Yeah. And I think these are broccoli. I don't know what these are. Those are cabbages. Close though. Very these close. are cabbages? Yeah, they're cabbages. Oh! The, these are these white broccolis. 
Is it the white um, thing that looks like broccoli? No, cabbage is what we make sauerkraut and coleslaw out of. Oh. I don't think you've had much cabbage before. And this is broccoli, right? Yeah, because look at this. This looks a lot like broccoli, doesn't it? Yep, this is even more broccoli, which Which turns we had, into flowers. Yeah, and which we had um, for dinner last night. Yeah. And over here, we have the calendula. Yep, that was perfect. Good job, dude. And there's a leaf here. I don't know why. <laughs> Chicken leaves. Chicken leaves. And as you see, we fed all the radish leaves we to fed the chickens. All, we fed all the leaves to the chickens, and that was their breakfast and dinner. And I think these are the garlics. Garlics. Yeah, we don't pull those up, though. They're not ready yet. Those are the garlics. And. Um, you know what these are? Is it the is it the mushroom that the um, onions? These are onions, but they're not they're not bulbing up yet. They have a long way to grow. These are the onions. Mm -hmm. Why did I say mushrooms? I don't know, cause you're a weirdo. <laughs> hey. And you know what goes in here, don't you? Yeah. What is it? This is the mint, but it's not growing yet. You know what so, I found earlier? Is this little guy right here. There's we need there. this little guy to grow. And it's still, you know why it's not growing? Because it's winter and it, there's a lot of wind. But hopefully the sun comes down here and makes this guy grow. That would be cool.